some new information about a spike in gang violence nationwide. Authorities say a surge in unaccompanied minors coming across the border are easy pickings for gangs. Doug McElway joins us live from Washington with more on that. Doug. Hi, John. This is not really a new problem. The migration of unaccompanied minor children to the U.S. has been an ongoing issue ever since the Civil War in El Salvador began back in 1979. Half of that country's population fled to escape the violence there, many of them to the United States. But unaccompanied minor children, especially males, are vulnerable to gang recruitment because of the lack of structure in their lives, the lack of family in their lives. In fact, one of the two main Salvadoran gangs, the 18th Street Gang, got its start in a Los Angeles prison and grew back in El Salvador as Salvadoran prisoners were released and deported back home. In recent months, law enforcement is seeing a spike in gang recruitment and activity in cities across America, including here in suburban Washington. You might come here without an extended family network, and I think that really is the prototype for the kind of person that might be recruited. Young, suffered trauma as a child, not um, in possession of a really extended or very firm family structure here, uh, that means they're looking for something. And it means that they might be more attuned or more capable of violence simply because of what they've seen in their lives. Apprehensions of unaccompanied minor children spiked to about 5,800 in August of this year, the last month for which statistics are available. Last month, a spokesman for HHS told Fox News, quote, in the last few months, screening procedures of children and sponsors has increased in their intensity, which we had not done previously. That is at least an indication that the feds are aware of this gang risk problem associated with unaccompanied childhood arrivals, even if they are not securing the border properly. John, back to you. Doug McElway in Washington. Scary stuff. Thank you.